What is Jasper AI and what can it do for your business? Well, that's exactly what I'm going to cover in this explainer and tutorial video. So let's jump right into it. Hey, this is Kevin from Solopreneur. And on this channel, I show you the best tools and strategies you can use to create and grow a passive income business online. If you're not using an AI assistant in your business right now, you're working way harder than you need to be. Jasper AI is one of the most popular AI assistants out in the market right now. And I'm going to explain exactly what it is, how it works, and even show you a few things you can do with it. The timestamps are down below, so feel free to skip around if you want to visit a certain section. But to kick things off, what exactly is Jasper AI? Well, Jasper is an AI assistant that can write pretty much anything you want for your business with just a few prompts. Picture it like your own content writing personal assistant that never takes a day off or quits on you. So it can write social posts, blogs, emails, product descriptions, website copy, ads, basically anything you need to write in your business, it can help you create. And all you have to do is give it some very simple prompts in plain English, just like you're talking to a real person and Jasper does the rest. Seriously, it's like magic sometimes. Let's use a real life example so you get a sense of how easy it is to use. Let's say we want to write a blog post. I'm going to show you quickly two ways you can do this. The first is you can actually just chat with Jasper like you're talking to your assistant. So let's say you're a fitness coach and you want to make a blog post about how you can be more consistent in the gym. Well, you can just simply tell Jasper, write me a blog post about five ways to stay consistent when working out at the gym. And you can just hit send, or you can hit enhance prompt and Jasper will help you give it better instructions, which is awesome. So you can see here, it's saying write act as a content writer, write a blog post with the title. So it's just like really knows what's going on. For example, you can suggest, planning workouts ahead of time, joining a gym buddy for mutual support. So it's doing research and suggesting things to itself to help itself write. I know, pretty impressive, right? <laughs> so you just hit send and literally in seconds, you're going to get a blog post. Title, five foolproof ways to stay consistent when hitting the gym. Jasper has just written this entire blog post for you in seconds. Now, if you wanted the call to action to be something like sign up for my coaching services, you could have added that in the text and Jasper would have added that to this entire blog post. So it's really that simple. You just tell it what you want and it will do it. Like you could say, create this into instead a video script. Write me a TikTok video script, one minute TikTok video script about five ways to stay, uh, consistent when working at the gym, you hit enhance prompt. I always find that 99% of the time it makes it better. Sometimes I use it without the enhance prompt, but you gotta play around and see what you like better. But look at this, in another <laughs> 10 seconds here, now it's just giving you a TikTok post for the exact blog post you just made. It's telling you the opening shots, the whole. So basically you can just do this. You can now ask it for an ad. You could ask it for an email. Basically you can just chat with it and it will create whatever you want. It's that simple. And if you're blown away by this and you're wondering how does this even work? Well, the way it works is Jasper has about four or five different AI models in its back end. It uses complex machine learning and so many other things. You really don't need to know the science behind it, but basically they're combining all of these different AI and machine learning algorithms in order to do this through pattern recognition, in order to do this through machine learning. As I said, it's absorbed all of this content. It's been trained on marketing and business content. So that's how Jasper is able to do this. So that's the first way that you can create blog posts or really anything, just chatting with one prompt and it'll create it for you. The second way you can do it is you can go to workflows and these workflows kind of guide you through the process if you want something a little bit more structured. So if you wanted a blog post, you could go to templates, workflows and go to blog post. And first you want to give it some context. You could say, I am a, an online fit coach. So you're just telling Jasper a bit about you. You can even say all kinds of things. You could say where you're located and so on and so forth. You could just give it as much detail as you want, but let's keep it simple. And let's say you want the blog post title to be five ways to stay consistent when working out at the gym. Who is the audience? Well, let's do something interesting. Let's just say it's new moms. Let's make it a little bit more complicated. And let's say your tone of voice, you want to be friendly and you go generate. And what it'll do now is it will actually create this output for you, right? 
right? And so this is your intro paragraph. Boom, five ways to stay consistent with working out in the gym. Perfect, you just got your intro paragraph. You can change it up if you like. Then you wanna get your outline. Just hit generate and it's now giving you the outline. You can simply just add it to this, right? So you have the outline and then what you wanna do is you wanna start getting each of these paragraphs, right? You really honestly just hit generate and next and it's just doing it for you. I'm doing this fast, but you can see here, it's just going to keep writing it and so on. I won't go through it for the sake of time. It's gonna write all your paragraphs for you. Then it's gonna write the conclusion for you. And this is just a little bit more of a systematic way of doing it. If you like the chat function more, you can do it that way. All an option that you can use and you can even use a hybrid. You can use the templates plus the chat. So there's even a way to use both at the same time with this menu here. So it's really customizable to the way you wanna use it. Now quickly, I wanna share a few other cool things that Jasper can do. So now not only can it write things, but it can actually create art as well. So let's say I want a ninja eating ice cream in a thunderstorm. That's what I tried last time. So you can just hit create art. You can actually modify all of these things if you want, but I'm just doing this for the sake of speed. And in a few seconds, you'll see that you have a ninja eating ice cream and all of these sorts of things. And so you can play around with this. I actually have an entire tutorial on the Jasper art function. So check the description down below. In fact, I have entire tutorials on making ads, social posts, video scripts. So if you want to learn how to do any of those things very specifically, specifically, check the description down below. The next thing that Jasper can do, which is super awesome, is it can imitate your tone and voice. So basically, if you have a very specific writing style, all you have to do is give Jasper access to something you wrote, either a blog post, a landing page, anything, or upload a document, and in a few seconds, Jasper will understand how you write, and it will write like you. So that's the first thing you can do. The other super awesome thing you can do is you can actually give it information. So say, for example, you have have very specific products or services and you want to give Jasper this information so we can reference it well this is where you add that special information it's like you're training Jasper you give it the information you have and then it will leverage that when writing its content so it's not just a generic AI like ChatGPT or something and one more cool thing Jasper also has a Chrome extension you can just get it from the Chrome store and this will let you use Jasper basically anywhere in your browser. So like, for example, let's say you're writing an email. I'm just making something up. Let's say you're talking to a friend and you're like, hey, where should we go for dinner? Suggest five places to go for a dinner in Toronto. Oh, let's make this more interesting. Write an email suggesting five places to go in Toronto on Saturday. You're thinking there's no way an AI could do this for me. I live in Toronto, by the way. So not only is it knows where Toronto is, it just researched five places and it wrote me the email. Yeah, so Jasper really is only limited by your understanding of how much it can do. It constantly surprises me. Like I didn't even know it could do this. I just tried it. I'm like, hey, I, I know Jasper's really smart. Could it do it for me? And I did and it just researched it, found it, wrote the entire email. So you can use this in your emails. You can use it in documents. You can use it everywhere. I really love the Chrome extension. It's really one thing that makes it stand out from something like say ChatGPT where you gotta go open this browser and try and type to it and it doesn't have the context and everything. So it's really, really cool. You can even just go in here and you can even pull up templates right from within here and in whatever document in your, you're in and whatnot. So that is a really awesome feature you should check out. So now that you understand what Jasper is and what it can do for your business, what you want to do next is try it for yourself. If you click the link in the description, you can get access to a seven day free trial so that you can give it a shot and try building out a few blog posts landing pages, emails, ads, whatever you want. The best way to know if it's going to really improve your workflow and work for your biz is to try it. I also have a free guide that teaches you how to get all of those things and more I mentioned created all at once in just one prompt. So make sure you grab that guide if you're interested in learning how to do that. And as I mentioned, I have in-depth tutorials for a lot of the things I talked about. So check the links in the description down below to get access to those videos. I also have a ton more tools tutorials and reviews on the channel so subscribe to the channel for more content and check out my playlists thanks for watching and i'll see you in the next video take care